Mr. Davies' Dose of Science. If this is your first time learning with us, welcome. If not, welcome back. Hello everyone, it's Mr. Davies. I hope you're all doing well and you're feeling healthy. Before we go any farther, don't forget, reach down, click right here, like it, and subscribe if you haven't already. That'll help out the channel and it'll help you out because you'll know when the next video is posted. We're going to start with a terrarium observation. Those of you who are growing your own terrarium are probably getting really excited about these, and that's great. There are multiple ways for you to record the amount of growth that you're experiencing in your terrarium. The easiest way <clears throat> is simply to draw it on a piece of paper. If you're going to use this method, that's great. Make sure you have today's date, the day you planted your terrarium, and how many days it's been growing. I know some of you have restarted terrariums, so it's important that you keep track of those dates. Other options for your observations would include using the templates that are on the web page and your paint program and drawing what you see. There are two different templates. One is set up to measure in inches. The other is set up to measure in centimeters. So use the template that's appropriate for you if that's your choice. This is the web page. Scroll down or click over here for Canvas. Channel here. Quick click to Canvas here. If you need those terrarium templates, right here under the terrarium templates, guys. Another option is to number your terrarium on the outside pre-measured, I guess is what you could call it. That's the kind that I tend to use. Um, this one is measured in inches and it works out pretty well. It's really easy. The last option that I have to show you is simply holding a ruler next to your terrarium. Again, this one's in inches. You can certainly measure in centimeters as well. No matter which way you make your observations, make sure you measure and save that so you can put it into a document or a journal. I've been using a document and I adjust this every time we make these observations. So I started at the top with today's date, May 19th, 2020. This terrarium was planted on April 27th. So it has been 22 days. It's been growing for quite a while. As I took a look this morning, I noticed that I do have some growth. There are a number of larger sprouts in the center and on the edge. And in the close-up, you can see some of those are five. One's almost five and a half inches tall. That's great. I also have some wispy plants, some lighter sprouts around the edges. That might be the grass growing. And those are up to about five, five and a half inches as well. So at the bottom, you should certainly write a couple of sentences. And what would I say? Something about growth has started. The sprouts are steadily getting bigger. And at this point, it's almost an inch a day, which is wonderful. No matter which method works for you, whatever's best is the one you should choose. Please choose your method now and make your observations in your journal or on your online document. If you need to pause the video, go ahead and pause it now. As always, stay healthy, stay safe. Until next time, this is Mr. Davies. Have a great day and keep on learning. If you learned something today, please like this video. If you think there is more you can learn, then click subscribe or consider coming back again tomorrow. The information, likenesses, and opinions in this video are the intellectual property of Mr. Mike Davies. While Mr. Davies does refer to other works owned by others, those resources are either parts of a public school district curriculum or they are readily available through open forums on the internet. Mr. Davies does offer his thanks and appreciation to any entity he has chosen to refer to or gather sound bites or clips from to emphasize his lessons. Mr. Davies is currently a professional member of the teaching staff 
for Central Dolphin School District in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, and is making, producing, and publishing these videos for the benefit of his students and other students during the current lockdown crisis. Mr. Davies does not make claim to all of the ideas and resources referenced in his videos. However, he does claim responsibility and rights to his likeness, opinions, and the academic content of these videos. He does not grant permission for any entity to copy or duplicate any portion of this video or any of his videos for private or personal gain.